peeps, what is up? My name is I am Simeon B. So we're doing things a little bit different on my channel. It's something uh, out of my comfort zone. Normally my channel was focused on, you know, funny videos, gaming, podcasts, that type of content. So I just thought I would uh, um, switch it up. I've been having car troubles, little car issues with my um, with my other car. Um, and I've been in the market looking around to get a, um, a car. I've been car shopping. Um, so, um, you know, I've been looking online. I thought about going to CarMax, but I didn't really want the hassle of going like to dealership, dealership to dealership. So I've been hearing about Carvana. Um, um, I've been hearing some, a lot of good things, been hearing a lot of bad things. Um, so I was kind of in the middle with the whole process, but I just thought, hey, I just might as well give it a try. So um, I started looking, um, you know, you go through the, um, you know, they, they, they give you a quote when you first sign in um, and sign up on the, um, the website. And what I do like about Carvana is the quote that you sign up, um, that you do when you first get on the website is the quote that's going to be when you actually... Um, um, finance your car so that's what i do like about it it's really no like games or no hidden fees at the end whatever your quote is or they they run you up as when you first start um the process is what it's going to be and when you search for cars it's going to um have those details with those numbers so that's what i liked like off the rip that's what i really really liked about Carvana. um so i was searching around and actually the, the process was um the process was pretty, pretty, pretty easy. Uh, I want to say, you know, they, you know, do your personal information, of course, verify your employment, um, and it actually worked pretty quick. Um, so whenever I was verified, they gave me, you know, my uh, my offer. Um, and like I say, the process was super easy. Um, so the first car that I looked up was, uh, I believe it was a 2021. I'm gonna I'm gonna throw the picture up in the video. It was a 2021 um, Nissan Rogue Sport. I really liked the car. Um, I really wanted to go with an Altima um, because I've just been in a, I don't know why I've just been wanting a Nissan. So I seen the Altima, I mean, well, I seen a Rogue. Um, I, I wanted to get an Altima, but it was kind of out of my price range. So I seen the Rogue and that's the car that I, um, I inquired about. So I inquired on the Rogue Sport, uh, the, so I was buying the Rogue Sport through one of Carvana partners. So they had to verify that um, that the partner still had the car and they didn't sell the car. So it's like a third party through Carvana. So um, I want to say they told me maybe like 24. It was going to take like 24 hours to verify to see if they had the car. So they just told me to be patient. And everything went through text messages. That's something else I'll add to the video. So they told me to be patient. Um, I drive trucks, semi trucks overnight. So I want to say literally the next day, the following morning that I got home, right as I was walking through the door, they told me um, that unfortunately that the car was sold. This was a rare, rare occasion, um, but it was sold. But they told me um, to not to worry, to keep looking. Um, and the quotes and all the information that I put with getting the road uh, sport would be applied to the next car that I go to. So I won't have to go and fill out all the information again, verify all my information again. It will just carry on to the next, uh, the next, the next vehicle. Um, I'm not gonna lie, y'all was a little sad about that. I really wanted the road. It wasn't my first choice. The Altima was my first choice. Getting the Altima was my first choice, but I, again, I seen that it was kind of out of my price range. So, uh, I was telling my wife, I was like, man, I kind of wanted that Rogue Sport. It was a family car. It was an SUV. I have a daughter that's uh, that's eight, and I have my son. My son is a little bit over uh, a year, so it would have worked out for us, right? All right, so I got back on the computer, and I started searching. So here's where it gets, it gets crazy, right? So I'm searching, I'm searching. I was kind of losing faith, like, man, I might not go with Carvana. I might have to go, you know, go to CarMax, go to... Uh, auto trader I, I might have to just go somewhere else right so I seen that they had a Nissan Altima a 2020 Nissan Altima with around like 50,000 miles so I, I checked the Carfax everything checked out um, 
So I would just, it was a little bit, it was a little bit more expensive a month, but surprisingly it was in my price range. So, okay. So I was just like, Hey man, what the hell? I just shot, I just shot a dart at it. And I just, um, I, I inquired on it. So they sent me the text. They told me again, they would check with the partners to see if they haven't sold the Ultima. I'm not gonna lie y'all. It was kind of like a too good to be true moment. So I was kind of like, whatever, I just put it in and I keep searching. So I got a text um, and they told me that they had the car. So my heart got to racing, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. My heart started racing. I'm like, whoa, okay. So they told me that they would, um, um, the, the car was um, approved, it was accepted um, and they would be giving me uh, more details. So, um, um, we set up a delivery day. So, I have been, like I told y'all earlier, I've been looking up reviews about Carvana, and one of the issues was the delays on the delivery day. So, I was kind of like, oh, man. So, they, they, they scheduled me for uh, the 1st of July. So, um, that, was my, that was my expected delivery date, and they told me if anything changed, they would let me know. Um, they're really good at communicating through text message. If you want to call, just um, you know, for security, because again, it's it's new. You know, what I mean, it's a new it's a new process. So um, it's a little weird, really, not dealing with you know a, a car salesman. So if you want more peace, you could just call just to get clarity. Because I called a few times. All right, maybe I called a little bit more than a few times. So. They told me that my deli my expected delivery date was on the 1st of Ju uh, July, and you guessed it, it got delayed. So it got delayed all the way into the 7th. So again, at this point, I'm about two or three weeks in with no car. So I'm catching Ubers every day. So I was a little frustrated with it when I seen the 7th. Uh, so I called him. Um, I talked to the guy. He was very nice. He told me that um, he seen an opening for the 5th. It was two days earlier, so... I was still upset, but I was just like, hey, you know, again, I kind of was already feeling like it was a little bit too good to be true. So um, he scheduled it for the fifth. And I'm not going to lie, y'all. Um, man, that was the longest, man. That was the longest four days of my life. So um, when it got close, I was kind of kind of expecting um, when it got close, I was kind of expecting them to delay it, but they didn't delay it. Um, I got a, a message from a different number. So make sure you guys be looking out for, you know, odd numbers texting you guys because it was a different number from the delivery driver this time. So the, 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 the can't talk. The delivery driver texts me um, and he gave me an ETA. He told me that it would be 23 minutes um until he got um to my location um so um uh, oh side note please guys because you guys have to get your insurance your insurance is going to be important they tell you you can get an you can get insurance before the delivery day or the exact days of the, the delivery day me personally i would do it before a day before um, but this time I did it the day of, um, so the delivery, uh, they have to wait until I got my insurance card sent to me through email. So that was a different, pro uh, another process, but the delivery guy was, man, he was very patient. He was very cool. He was very kind. So that worked out. Yes, sir. Looking good.
blue. Nice rims on it. Thing look good. Thing look ass. Loaded. No damage. No scratches or dings like I thought it probably would be. Inside is nice and clean. Smells like a brand new car. Oh man, Kavana did they thing, baby. Everything looks slightly like look like a brand new car. Love to see see the back. Back seats is nice and spacious, nice and clean. My son, I have a toddler, man, so I'm really, <laughs> I really got to get some seat protectors, some, some things for him. AC blow nice and cold. Touch screen. The, yeah, man, everything was good. Um, so far, man, they I test I test drove the car, um, and everything checked out. Um, so at this point, um, you get seven days to um, decide if you want to keep the car. Um, and I'm I'm. I am just excited. I, I'm in love with my car right now. Um, man, the car is beautiful. The car is beautiful. I'm enjoying it. Um, and I want to say, man, uh, my Carvana delivery experience was A+. Plus. Um, besides me getting delayed the delivery, the entire process was smooth. I would recommend it for anybody that's, that's looking for a car that's car shopping that don't want to go through the hassle of dealing with car salesmen or dealership hopping, I would definitely recommend Carvana um, to anybody. Um, and yeah, man, um, I will give you guys an update. I need to get this baby tinted out. Um, I will give you guys an update um, once I get my titles. Um, they say it'll be about um, um, 30, I want to say to 40 days um, until I get... Um, and I get the car uh title buyers tag receipts and things like that um in this folder so yeah man everything was cool um if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure y'all subscribe give me a thumbs up any information that i left out or that you guys um, um have a question about please i will try my best to answer all you guys questions and yeah man i'll tap in soon i'll give you guys an update peace